Google selling Motorola Mobility. That's a handset unit it bought back in 2012 uh, to Lenovo for $2.9 billion. Remember, it bought it for $12.5 billion. It does hold on to most of the patents that it acquired in that purchase. Uh, Lenovo shares, interestingly enough, are down 8% in Hong Kong. Today. Yeah. Analysts there say Lenovo paid too much for this mm. one. It's fascinating, and I thought the reporting was a little off the mark. The tech crew did a better job. Bloomberg did a better job of breaking it down, where everybody just looked at $12 billion and got take away there, and they right. got big loss like, for oh, Google. Yeah. Baloney, Google it's the official surveillance back of the envelope. This is my personal stationery. There's the envelope, and, on the back, and there's the back. There's the math, and we thank all sorts of sources for this, including Mashable and Bloomberg. They got the $12 number out here, take out cash, take out setup. There's the value, uh, Alex Steele, of the patents. $5.5 billion. Then you've got the, the tax losses carried forward. Here you've got like the trip, the cocktail party in Davos and all the other expenses, and you come out with an actual profit. So what you're Google. saying is Google did not lose money on this purchase. No way. And you're saying that this was a good deal for Google. The, the, what the reporting I hear from experts is this was a really good deal for Google, and as you say, with a Lenovo price. Right, but uh, the other question hit. is, was it a mistake to get into in the first place, right? I mean, it, yeah, you, you that's had a the, uh, Brad Stone in Business Week saying that Google had Apple envy, right? Wanted to control the whole uh, stream of the phone yeah. from the software, and then said, you know what, that's not really where we want to go. And okay. they're still going to focus on the hardware, right? I mean, they still bought right. Nest. I was just looking at a Citigroup analyst report, and they said that at, at some level, this removes one of the awkward mm -hmm. uh, conflicts of interest that Google had with Samsung and the other developers and right. companies that use Android software. It now puts them in a better position, and there's going to be less acrimony between Right. You have uh, Evercore saying it can lift EPS in 2014 by 4%, so lifting earnings okay. by 4% next year.